30 plus uses for the Shamog and a channel update. Hello, my friends, this is the Art of Prepping. Before we get into the uses of Shamogs, I just like to say that after a lot of trial and error, I've settled down into the Rothko brand. I like the Rothko a lot. I like the standard weight of Rothko Shamogs. Um, they average around 42 by 42 inches. Traditional Shamogs, you know, typically are 44 by 44. So just a, a slightly smaller variant of the traditional size, but they work just fine, at least for me. They also make lightweight versions. So you might be interested in those uh, for just summertime use. Uh, they do cost a few dollars less uh, than the standard weight. Uh, but in terms of the cost for the standard weight, the one I like the most, it typically runs about $12 with free shipping on Amazon. So let's get into some of the uses here. Uh, you could use your Shamog as a neck, face, or head wrap, a dusk mask, a bug cover, first aid sling, compression bandage, bandage holder or tie, and a tourniquet. Fire tender, it could be used in the form of char cloth. You could use your Shamog as a signal panel or a signal flag, a means to keep body parts warm or to keep sun off the skin. It could be used to make a gear pouch, a food pouch, a bear bag, a food prep surface, makeshift cordage or rope for repairs and other uses. It could be made into trail markers, a water pre-filter, a water or dew collector, a rag or a sweat towel, makeshift socks, or to insulate the foot or hands. You could also make a makeshift mittens, a belt, backpack strap, a pot holder, a mini blanket, a baby swaddler, knee pad, wrist, arm, or hand wrap when in a knife fight or when dealing with hot surfaces. A cleaning patch or patches for firearms, snow goggles, restraint for the wrist and legs, cushion uh, to, um, to wrap breakable items, a makeshift pillow, and uh, a trap cover over a pit or hole if you're trying to procure food, a poultice wrap, a strainer, a net, and finally a lamp wick. So those are some ideas. Now we do have a channel update. Uh, this is a very simple update, but we are gonna have a new format and it's very simple. Uh, when the last video that I make hits a hundred views or better, I will make another video. And uh, this goes for both channels, the art of prepping and everyday prepper. Uh, so once again, uh, when we hit over a hundred at or a hundred views um, that's my uh, signal from you guys that you want another video otherwise I'm gonna hold off and uh, and let everyone catch up so uh, thank you for your support thanks for watching you guys take care